Good morning, my name is Vera Nash. I'm a virtual assistant at Trusty Oak, and I also, for the last seven years, have worked as a um, fundraising consultant for nonprofits. Um, and as you know, the pandemic has not been particularly kind to nonprofits. Um, unfortunately, one of the things that the organizations I work with have in common is that they struggled last year really with converting their usual annual uh, signature fundraiser into a, a virtual event. Um, doing something like just doing an online gala or an online silent auction just didn't have, um, they just seemed to really be lost in translation. They didn't result in the same amount of interest, the same amount of attendance, the same amount of donations. Um, and so we started thinking about ways to more creatively um, present an online fundraiser and I would like to um, share some of those ideas with you today um, and also by the way if you did do an event last year and it was disappointing I hope that it doesn't discourage you um, it's going to be very different this year you have the benefit of hindsight you have a lot more time to plan you don't have to throw anything together in the last minute um, and in my opinion, it's definitely worth it. It's definitely something that could make a huge difference in the amount of services that you're able to offer to people who really need it in the coming year, you know? And, um, and if you do um, decide that you want to go for um, a virtual fundraiser, um, a virtual assistant is a very great person to have on your team because, you know, since the whole event is virtual, they can really be involved in every step of the process, from brainstorming to, um, you know, figuring out the logistics, making those phone calls, promoting the event, and even figuring out what the local rules are for accepting donations and making sure that you comply with them. And hopefully, um, your event will be a really great success and it will be something that is a win-win-win for you, your donors, and your constituents.